Um, yes, sir. Uh, I want to start off by asking you about the uh, the convention going on hold this week, as it did, or, or, or today. Um, how do you feel about that? Well, I think that's appropriate. Look, uh, we're all concerned uh, about what's happening with Hur Hurricane uh, Gustav, and uh, we're all praying th that that will turn out all right. And I might add that, uh, you know, we're going to have to go forward with the convention, but I think using Monday as a no-event day is probably a good thing. And frankly, uh, we're all concerned about our folks down in the, uh, in the, in the Louisiana and Mississippi areas uh, and other areas as well. Uh, and, and in the larger picture, uh, you were a supporter of Mitt Romney in the primary, um, uh, and, and there had been a lot of talk about whether John McCain had enough conservative bona fides. Uh, do, do you think the party has successfully unified behind him this week? Look, John McCain's a true conservative. You know, he's a maverick, uh, which means that he does try to put things together with the, with the Democrats, as do I. And frankly, I have a lot of admiration for John. I, I support John fully. Uh, yeah, I was a Mitt Romney supporter because I felt like Mitt could bring an added economic dimension here that is very much needed in this country. But I'm really thrilled with Sarah Palin. I, I have to admit that I think John really hit it out of the park with, uh, with Sarah because she's tough, she's smart. She has more executive experience than uh, any of the other candidates for president and vice president. She has more knowledge about energy, the number one issue in this country, than any of the other three. And frankly, she's a tough gal who's uh, made her own way in life and done a very good job of it and who's willing to stand up and be counted. And I think we're very lucky to have her uh, accept this position. And uh, last question, uh, on that same note, um, the uh, platform looks, looks like it's going to have a, uh, it's going to endorse a constitutional amendment to uh, prohibit gay marriage. It's going to also uh, oppose to embryonic stem cell research. Um, it says no amnesty. Is, is, is this, uh, th these are some of the things that uh, McCain has been on the other side of. Is that going to be an issue at all? Well, to, to be honest with you, uh, on stem cell, embryonic stem cell research, I believe that uh, the being pro-life is helping the living too. And I've met with 43 Nobel laureates and all kinds of other people, including ethicists on both sides, ministers on both sides, activists on both sides. And I came down the same way John McCain has come down. And about 80% of the people in this country agree with it. Now, to the extent that we can get pluripotent cells from, from uh, uh, skin cells or any other type of uh, uh, form, uh, that's, that's, a, that's a step in the right direction and I support that as well. The first question was on uh, gay marriage. Look, all John, John is very fair to gay people, so am I. But we do draw the line when it comes to the definition of marriage. We just do not believe that we should change that defi definition. Now, to do an accommodation or to make it possible so that gays are treated fairly in our society, I'm for that. I think John is for that. I think most thinking people are for that. But when it comes to marriage, we draw the line. And I think John is absolutely right on that. Uh, do, do you believe the uh, party platform, though, is more conservative than the actual nominee? It always has been. I mean, I, I've been here, I don't know how many conventions I've been to, but plenty over my 32 years in the Senate. And the platform is always more conservative than our nominees as a general rule. And that's not a bad thing. I think that's a, that's a good thing because it keeps people's feet to the fire and and lets them know that there's a considerable number of, there, there's a considerable number of people throughout our country who, who who feel very deeply about some of these very strong conservative issues. And I I personally feel deeply about them. All right, all right. Thank you good very to much. See you. Okay.